Now, if you're eligible for pre-settled status or you've received pre-settled status, you must ensure that you've been continuously resident in the UK for a five year period in order to be eligible for settled status later. This means you can't be absent for more than six months in any 12 month period. Now, the Home Office calculates absences on a rolling basis. This means that if you have had absences in 2019 and you've also have had absences in 2020, then these absences can be added together. If these absences added together exceed six months in a 12 month period, then you might have broken your continuous residence in the UK and this puts at risk your eligibility for settled status later. This is the rule as it stands now and you need to be conscious of that rule and meet it in order to be eligible for settled status later and not rely on this rule changing at any time in the future because it might not. Thank you for listening.